investigation into medical marijuana mm. use at Oregon daycares. We got some pretty exclusive video. We turned it over to authorities and then they did a surprise checkup. Our reporter Carla Castaño tracked down the governor to ask him some tough questions about what's next. Carla? Well, Governor Kitzopper oversees the agencies allowing daycare workers to smoke medical marijuana. I also have gotten copies of the Alphabet Academy's daycare license from the state. The special condition allowing them to smoke medical marijuana is supposed to be printed on the bottom of the license, but I found out it's not. After giving the governor several chances to address the issue of medical marijuana at daycares, I went directly to him. Were you aware about that before our story? Uh, again, I'm not up to speed on this, and I'd be glad to get back to you. Okay, when will you be available for an interview? We'll, talk to, we'll, we'll set it up with you. Okay, because you've declined multiple interview requests. The governor's Republican opponent, Dennis Richardson, just informed me he has drafted legislation. It would require written notice to parents or legal guardians about any daycare employee or any other person regularly on the premises of a daycare who has a medical marijuana card. Now, coming up in my full investigation at 6, I found out the state waited almost a month to test some of the Alphabet Academy kids for exposure to pot with their parents and a poison control expert have to say about that, plus what other daycare providers are allowed to smoke medical marijuana in Oregon. Live in the newsroom, Carla Castaño, Coin6 News. I know, Carla, you've been trying to get a hold of the governor for quite some time. Now, if you have a story for our investigators, call our tip line, the number on your screen right there, 503-464-0861. You can always send us an email at reportedatcoin.com.